Hi everybody, today we're going to take a look at the Lighthawk Sprint. It uh, it's, looks like a short course truck. It is two wheel drive, has 2.4 gigahertz digital control, and it says here it can do 50 kilometers an hour or 30 miles per hour. It is a limited edition of 1500 only. Let's take a look. Uh, very nice. Like the paint scheme, looks good. Let's see the features here. So it's got a 2.4 gigahertz controller. It has shock absorbers, tough flex and body, full width rear bumper, uh, fully independent suspension, and it has a high output motor. Soft all-terrain rubber tires, side Nerf bars, charger and battery included. Okay, looks good. And that's why I bought it. So let's open it up. time the uh, steering wheel was stuck inside there okay so here we go we go here we have a charging adapter Gives us the uh, double A's. Here's the charger, and here's the battery. It's a 7.4 1500 mAh lithium ion. Comes with the instructions and the tire tool. Here's the controller, so it has your steering trim and your throttle trim, your power button, antenna, takes four double A's. Chinese writing on the Duracell. And there's the uh, power light and it's flashing because it has no signal. So let's get the truck out. So, I think this was uh, tied down with twist ties, but somebody has unboxed this already at the hobby shop, it looks like, to give it a test drive for themselves. It was the last one in the store, so I don't know if this was their demo or not, but I should have looked at it closely, but I would have bought it either way because it was the last one. And here we go. So you got four body clips here, it's got a uh, nice soft suspension, it even has these uh, mud flaps in the back, nice little detail. Now I do have, I do have the other Lighthawk uh, RC trucks, the uh, Lighthawk Blast and the Lighthawk Brute. 
So this one looks like it's built on the same chassis. And they claim that the Lighthawk Blast and Brute can only do 35 kilometers an hour. So I wonder what makes this one go 50. So here's problem number one. This battery compartment has this clip going right through it and it sort of jams on the sidebar here. So there's a pain. Finally, and now the battery connector is buried somewhere inside here. I have to thread it through this hole. This connector type is called JST. All right, I heard some power happening there. The servo powered up. I'll just thread it back in the hole here. Shove it in there. I'm gonna shove some more of this cable in the hole. Troublesome pin here. Okay, and let's press the, the uh, steering here. All right, so we have control. Very good. All right. See. Very nice. So yeah, I don't know why what would give this one more power than the other models, the uh, Blast or the Brute. So you see, this has a motor guard. actually said on the website that would have a fan and I don't see any fan on here I don't see any motor fan I didn't say anything about it on the box and I don't see it on the uh, ESC So we'll just have to race it outside against a brood or a blast to see if it really is 50 kilometers an hour. Unfortunately, it's snowing outside here where I am, so I won't be doing that anytime soon. It just seems to have different uh, tires, I guess, and the extra rear and side bumpers would be the only difference from the other models. So there you have it, the Lighthawk Sprint. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.